guys how are you doing i'm a motai a business lord expert if you're new to my channel please do not forget to hit the subscribe button before you continue this video and watch to the end you have to learn from this especially those in nigeria so these um loans that you people um download applications for and borrow money online i don't know why you keep doing it i i i hope you learn from this video and I'll share a an article with you from my senior colleague, um, Faya Malan Moses. He's a tech expert, a tech law expert. When I read this article, I learned that these um, applications, these loan applications, they get into your messages. Like, how can you agree to a term and condition that allows a company to get into your privacy? So no privacy for you simply because you want to borrow how much? 20,000, 100,000, and then you jeopardize your, your data protection. That's wrong. It's not just for individuals, especially if you're a business owner. If you actually had your business going properly, you have all your documentation, your, your register with the CAC, your tax, um, tax clearance, your tax certificate is cleared, you have a tax clearance certificate, I mean, then you can actually borrow money from the bank. The legal way yes they, they have high interest rates but at least your data is protected i'm saying this because i i got like two different calls on two different occasions from this application or from this loan people say hello sunday ak michael blah 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 is always so 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 and is on the run and i'm like how did they even get my number in the first place yes they got my number because you the borrower after downloading their application decided to click, click yes yes accept i agree to all of their terms and conditions without even reading through you agree to your life your entire life being out there in the open you agree to being vulnerable you agree to being embarrassed by these people simply because you want to borrow money i mean i know life can be difficult being an entrepreneur can be a whole lot of work but as much as possible, try to avoid these um, applications. They, they, they get into your messages. They get into your contacts. So, so long as I'm on your contact list, they can reach out to me. Stating that you are a fraudster, you are a criminal. Even when you are not, simply because you are owing them. That's, that's not civil. That's not ideal. And I'm not trying to like, destroy the market of these people. I'm just trying to warn you to be careful what you download what you get yourself into as a business owner as an individual your data protection is very important if you want to learn more about this i would share the link to fire malan's um, article with you you would learn a whole lot we need to be careful guys we really need to be careful and please can you loan people stop dropping my number can they stop calling me already i don't know can they stop it's really annoying I had to take time off work to film this. Be careful what you agree to. Be careful what you accept on the internet. It's very, very important. If you found this video useful, please do not forget to like it, give it a thumbs up, and share with people that like to borrow money online. I mean, they should learn something from this. Like, come your way again some other time. I'm a Motari Alemero. Bye.